The cash coming in from the slot machines wasn't enough for Marcello, so he continued his drug trade. But in 1938, he got caught selling 23 pounds of marijuana to an undercover officer. At the time, the biggest pot bust in New Orleans history. Marcello would spend a year in the Atlanta Federal Penitentiary on narcotics charges for distributing marijuana, but his political connections probably enabled him to get out quickly. <laughs> about Marcello's deep trouser pocket in which he, he could carry as much as twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000. He would just go around reaching into that deep pocket and just pay off everybody, policemen, judges, and cold cash. <laughs> 